Sir, we are receiving reports of gender reveal parties on decks four, seven, 10, and 16. Who wants to buy a house? Who wants to buy a house? Who wants to buy a house? Good morning, Toastmasters. Good morning, neighbors. This is the Country Lane Real Estate Update for 2020. Let's begin with the city of San Jose. In August 2019, there were 500 new listings and there were about 490 sales. Come down to December 2019, there were 175 new listings, and just under 400 sales for the previous two months. Now, after the holidays, the number of new listings just blasted off <clears throat> until March, about March 10th, where we got the shelter in place orders, and then things dove and dove and dove until late April, when uh, confidence and procedures returned to the market, it leveled off. We now have more listings now than we did at this point last year. Let's look at the homes that sold in the city of San Jose. It was around, for the winter of 2019, it was just under 400. It took its normal uh, decrease during the holidays. And then throughout February and March, it increased until again, that February 10th, um, the March 10th shelter in place order where it peaked into quite a dive and late April by May and June, the procedures were set in place and people were back to buying houses. And once again, the numbers are just about where they were in 2019. Let's look at the sales prices for the city of San Jose. In August, 2019, it was a million fifty. It stayed about, um, about that point throughout the winter until after the holidays where it took off and rose and rose and rose until that March 10th date where it took a quick dive. It did find rock bottom, it stayed there throughout spring and early summer and rose up again. The median sales price for the city of San Jose is now $200,000 higher it was at this point last year. Let's look at zip code 95129. In August 2019, there were 12 new listings. There were 11 closed transactions. Come down to December 9, 2019, there was only one new listing, 10 closed transactions. Immediately after the holidays, Sellers wanted to get in on that good market, and they came, and they came, and they came until March 10th. Then they left, and they left, and they left. We bottomed out in April, meandered up and down, up and down. We're still quite a bit higher this year than we were last year. Now let's look at closed transactions. And we said that in December 2019, there were 10 transactions closed. <clears throat> that dropped off as the holiday season. And in uh, February, it hit bottom at around six transactions. It meandered up and down. Late April, it really took off, skyrocketed. And again, we are at the same place or better than we were at this point, 2019. How's the market? Remember when you were looking for toilet paper? Let's look at sales prices for zip code 95129. August 2019, it was just under a million eight. Throughout the winter, it fluctuated up and down between one six and two million. In February 2020, it was at a million eight. And throughout the early part of the year, it skyrocketed until March 10th, March 15th where it plunged down $400,000 in a month. Ouch, that might leave a mark. Then the market bottomed out, buyers returned with confidence, 
We are now currently in zip code 95129. Median sales price is $300,000 higher than it was at this point last year. And here it is, country lane, single family home sales data. Today we are going to focus mostly on year 2020. If you'd like to see the data and my predictions for year 2019, at the end of this video, there'll be a two links. The link on the left will take you to Country Lane 2019, where you can review last year's market data and my predictions. On the right is my latest real estate tip. Go ahead and click that if you'd like to see my latest real estate tip. Key numbers for Country Lane neighborhood. In 2011, the average sales price was $835,375. In 2018, it was $1,861,744. In 2019, it decreased to $1,692,455. In 2020, it increased to $1,862,000. $931. Buyer and seller procedures for real estate sales bring shelter in place. There are no longer open houses. There is a much bigger emphasis on video presentations and digital signatures. Homes can be viewed in 30 minute time frame after the buyer has submitted the PEED to the listing agent. Wait a minute, what's a PEED? And where do I get it? And what do I do with it? Get it from me or whatever broker you're working with. All visitors to properties must follow the rules. No more than three people, including agents, in the home at one time. And of course, everybody is wearing a mask. The procedures and paperwork have had many small revisions, call them tweaks. They will continue to cooperate with the sellers and brokers. Let's get to the closed transactions. Summary, despite the many challenges in the year 2020, the Country Lane neighborhood property values are at their highest point ever. For the latest market updates, go to my Facebook pages, facebook.com Country Lane Real Estate and facebook.com Real Estate Video page. Or call me at 408-898-0186. Joseph Colgan, Oh, well, Banker, thank you so much. I look forward to working with you.